Hi friends. So a couple of weeks ago, I shared with you that there were a couple of projects that I was working on. Well, today I'm sharing one of those projects. I'm here in my master bedroom in the master bath, and I am sharing different ways that you can style your garden tub window in your master bath. So I was sent these G curtains, and these G curtains are a single curtain rod. The size that I have is 44 by 82, and it features a design finial with a mirror finish. They have adjustable brackets and maximum flexibility. This finial is perfect for any decor style, and this rod was easy to install and looks simply beautiful above my garden tub. Now, I decided to use some window shears that I purchased from Ross to accent this window. And this is the first style that I'm using and I took two shears that were 84 length, um, inches in length and I gathered them on each side and I took one um, the left side and swagged it as it gathered to the right side and the right um, length of the shears swag to the left side and both sides you see they kind of hang on the side now I love this I think it is very pretty I think it gives this window a very billowy type of look and I've had it like this for a couple of days but that's not all because what you guys don't know is my favorite tools to use around my house are rubber bands and the stick pins with the clear um, heads and so my next style that I'm going to share with you I will be using that now you see on this um, style this, um, that I have now I've taken one of the end ends and I just have it swag and then on the left side I brought that shear down and I have a top hanging over see that that is my top secret I have so many of those push pins around my home I don't like having holes in my walls and those holes that those clear head push pins leave you can barely see it now I think this style is very romantic and I think it looks perfect in this um, above my tub. What do you guys think? Now the next style that I have once again I am using a rubber band and my push pins. I have both of my shears and I just gather them just pull the gathers together kind of tightly but then when I bring the gathers over to where I want it to hook and cascade I will once again use my pin and my push pins and my rubber bands and I will gather it and I will stick the pin in and hook over the rubber band now what you can also do is kind of use another rubber band and billow it here and or you can just let it stay straight the way that I have. So I have shared with you one of my design secrets that I use around my home. I love using rubber bands and push pins and the, this was the perfect example to share with you how you can use both to create a very billowy look in your space. Now I think this look is very romantic. What I could also do is take a swag, another piece of sheer fabric or curtain and kind of swag it over here and have it kind of drooping down on both sides. I think that would look fantastic. Now I don't know which look I'm going to decide to keep here. You will have to stay tuned. 
I would like to thank G Curtain for sending me this beautiful rod. If you are interested in this rod, I will link all of the information below and you can check them out. And if you use any unconventional items in your home decorator, I am curious to know what and how you use them. So please make sure you leave it down in the um, comment area below. So guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, give me a thumbs up. If you're new to Warning's House, I would love for you to subscribe. And as always, guys, the next time you're in town, you can always stop by Warning's House. And I'll see you in the next video. Bye-bye.